Alright, welcome back to The Walking Dead. Let's keep going. I guess I should go get ready. Uh, say what now? You said you'd need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are, right? Or the dead. Um... Well, it might be safer here. Clementina, I think it'd be safer for you to stay here with Omid. But what if something happens to him while you're gone? What do you mean? He's sick. If he doesn't oh, get better, crap. you know, he might try to hurt me. That's true. That is true. Can't I come with you? Oh, jeez. You know, I kind of feel safer with me. Okay, you can come. But you have to promise to stay quiet and do exactly what you're told the whole time we're there. Okay, I'm going to go get ready. I don't trust that dead corpsey guy. I think he's going to turn into a zombie and potentially eat her. But then, if she dies when she's with us, I don't like these decisions and whatnot. Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? Absolutely, Kenny. I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? so? So, we're gonna have a capacity problem. Assuming oh. everyone makes it back alive, there ain't gonna be room for everyone. What are you trying to say? Just giving you a heads up is all. Thought you ought to know. Hey guys, what's up? Who the hell is this? This is Bree, she can help us. How? Help us how? I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their mm -hmm. supplies. I know the oh. layout. With her help, we're Fair running enough. out faster. Anyone have a problem with that? I guess not. Nope. And what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. All right, awesome ninja lady. Hold up just a sec. You ready? Ready. Hey, whoa, hold on a minute. You're not taking her with us. Did you not hear anything I said about the kind of place Crawford is? If you take her in there me. and they find her... I'm not leaving her alone in the house with only Omi to protect her. It's just not happening. For what it's worth, I don't think it's a great idea either. She's coming. Deal with it. You heard the man. Let's move out. Jeez. Kenny, no. I mean, Ben. Ben. Sorry, guys. Ben. Ben, you didn't tell me you were an axe murderer. You gotta warn a guy. Good golly. You think you know. Be it. Uh, We're right underneath the center of Crawford. The old school should be. Thank you, Master Splinter. Okay, people. This is it. Remember the plan. We stay quiet. Yes. We stay hidden. And we stay together. We find what we need, and we get the hell out before anyone even knows we're there. Got get it? on up out of here. Get on up. And that part about staying close. It goes double for you. All right. And take a look. What you got? They like come and we want to go home. Let's go. Boom. Headshot. Where is everybody? There should be guards patrolling. What? Are you disappointed? It's just strange, is all. I think uh -oh. I see one over there by the door. Okay. Me and Kenny will sneak up, trying to take him out quiet. The rest of you wait for our signal, then follow us over. Everybody got it? Okay, Kenny, let's do this quiet. No shooting unless there's no other choice. Right behind you. 
Wait, so we're just gonna kill this guy? Is that the plan? I guess. What the fuck? Oh, alright, yeah, good, that's fine. Problem killing zombies. What the pirate fuck zombies. Is a inside here? Get inside fast. I think that perchance they're all walkers. Or maybe they said the walkers on the streets to guard them. School, the last place I would want to be. I think worse is a zombie. Is a zombie trying to teach you math? Smile and learn. Like an oxymoron. Fuck! Fuck! Do you think they saw us? I don't think so. I don't think so. I think we're good. For now, at least. For now. For now. What the hell happened here? I thought this place was supposed to be secure. What always happens, I guess. In the end, the dead always win. Oh man, we are so screwed. No, this is good. Why is this good? How is this good? What? How the fuck is this good? Before, everyone at Crawford was smart and they had guns. Now they're dumb and they don't. Hey. I Trying to look on the bright side here. Doesn't make sense, Master Splinter. I agree. So long as we don't let him box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. Do you even have any idea how many of them are out there? In your no. pansy. You want to do a head count? Or do you want to get so what I'd we need and get the hell there. out of here? Come on. I think I know which way to head. Alright. I got a bad feeling about this. Well, put your man pants on and let's go. Posse out. Here's a tip, guys. Don't open that door. You're not gonna tell me that's where supplies are, Just are you? Keep moving. Just keep swimming. Here. That lady kind of looks like my aunt. Just throwing that out there. Looks okay. Everybody in. Hello. Had a Scooby Doo moment there. She just got a weird look in her eye. Armory. <laughs> That's funny. Oh. Figures. Whoa. Looks like they were using this room as some kind of command center. Us. Okay, so now what? Where do we start looking? Everywhere. Here. Where? Where's here? Just give me a sec. Let me use my mind powers to plot out this map. Fuel. Where can we find some fuel for the boat? There's a maintenance shed across from the playground here. If they were storing fuel, that's probably where it'll be. Makes sense. Battery. Any idea where we could find a battery? Uh, maybe at the auto shop. There used to be one in the alley outside the fire escape. 
Yep, it's called Herman's. You can't miss it. What about Herman. the medicine? Right here. Nurse's station. They were using it as a medical facility. How do you know that? Is it not obvious? Just makes sense, doesn't it? Does logic could not tell you that. Okay, I'll make the run to the maintenance shed for the fuel. It'll be faster if I go with you. I can take you right to it. I'll come too. No, two people's enough. You stay here, see if you can use any of those tools we brought to get that armory door open. We might need to shoot our way out of here. I'll go for the medicine. I'll come with you. I know what to take. Okay. Guess that leaves me to go find us a battery. I'll go with you. Watch your back. Okay, we've got a plan. Everyone be careful. Stay close to one another. We'll all meet back here. Good Pussy luck. Pussy out. See the way she's eyeballing me. No. No. What about me? What can I do? I need you to stay here with Ben and watch over our command center. I'm putting you in charge of it, okay? I don't think she's gonna fall for that. You're crap. leaving me with Ben? I'm not leaving you with Ben. I'm leaving him with you. Understand? Oh, okay. Back before you know it. I bet she could handle herself better than Ben could handle himself. Anybody? Thing? Flag. Look at the flag. The George Georgia State flag. flag. A lot of history there. Oh. Not that what, matters can't, much now, I guess. Can't look at the American flag. Only the Georgia flag. That's the only flag I'm interested in. Can I talk to people before I leave? You okay, Clem? Yeah. This desk is just like the ones we have in my school. I know it's weird, but I kind of miss it, being in school. Hold your tongue, child. Uh, really? Really? I would have thought school would be the last thing you'd miss about all this. No, I liked it. Huh, what was your favorite subject? History? Well, what do you know? Mine too. Yeah, I slept through most of history. Be normal again? Just like the way they were before. I got D in history. Nobody knows. I don't think anyone knows the answer to that, Clem. Maybe there's somebody out there working on a way to fix this. Some kind of cure, maybe. There's just no way to know. I hope so. Yes, yes, we all do. You hold on to that hope. It's the one thing none of this can take away. It's more than a feeling. Paste. <laughs> Clementine, don't let Ben eat that paste. Who knows what it'll do to him. Globe, don't want to look at the globe. Hey, you need any help with that? Thanks, I got it. Just once, I'd like to do something useful, you know? Yeah, that'd be great. Oh. Well, uh, I'll let you get on with it. I'm thinking that. I just didn't want to be rude about it. No, wait. There is something you can help me with. Something that's been oh, on my really? mind. I could use your opinion. Uh-oh. What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. He's a good guy, you know? And it's eating me up knowing what I know. I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Ben, come on. This again? It's my fault Doc and Katya got killed. Wait, how's that if your I fault? If I screwed up back at the motor inn, they'd still be alive. How am I supposed to just carry something like that around? I have to tell him. Oh yeah, that's right, that thing. Oh, I should tell him. I but agree. I don't... I think you should tell him. Just not now. You don't get it, Lee. What am I supposed to do yeah. whenever he talks about Katya and Duck? Just nod and pretend like it wasn't my fault. I yeah, do that. Do that's fine. Ben, listen. Kenny seems like he's got his shit back together because right now he's got a purpose, but he's still in a real bad place. You tell him now, he's gonna lose it, and then we're all screwed. There'll come a time when he's ready to hear it, but it's not now. Not yet. I hear you. I'm gonna get back to this. Do it. 
I gotta stop right there, guys. I'll see you in the next next episode.